Alright everyone, today I'm going to be doing sort of a speedrun of Meridia from Super Metroid, you know, something a little different. Something that is, something that is not my usual brand of insanity, you know? Actually, I think it go down here. Okay, here we go. So in order to get past this part, you gotta do this here. And then press the jump button and that happens. This is where you get introduced to Mark Troy. Or what happens when the space pirates get extremely desperate. Time to fight Bot Room. Okay, this is easy. This is an odd sort of speed run. What this is Like, what if I was just trying to beat Dragon as fast as possible, who is the boss of Meridia for the record? Yeah, by the way, missiles are essential here. Alright, so that puts him down. We'll keep moving. What I'm about to show you is basically what happens when you complete Metroid. I mean, Meridia. Or basically, how to complete Meridia, which is this world I'm in, the water world. Technically the third world of the game you should go to. Area of the game. The third area of the game you want to go to. After Brutus. <laughs> <coughs> After Brutus started the wrecked ship. Now the thing about the speedrun is that it's designed with the end goal in mind of simply beating um this world as fast as possible oh great now I gotta beat it with these things. Now let me show you how to beat Draga. Alright, quick. Alright, now that that thing's butt. <coughs> <coughs> 
That thing's busted. Let's do this. Come on out, girl. Yeah, Dragon's a girl, by the way. Click, click, click. Alright, now that I got him to grab me. Hey, this way. And that's Dragon, pretty much. That's actually the first time I've done that with meaning. Alrighty. Yeah, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Yeah, I just beat Meridia in five minutes. Thanks, Crocomire, for the grappling beam.